I was just gonna finish with my DH gate bag haul but I have a bag right in front of me that I need to show you guys that I got for a very <laughs> let me say just a really good deal excuse me um, I've got it in a Bottega Veneta dust bag And no, it's not Bottega Veneta. It's not. It is not Bottega Veneta. Um, I just really like that cover, the dust bag, and I've had that one for a while. Um, this bag that I'm about to show you, I got, let's see, two months ago, I think. I thought about using it and the only thing that's stopping me is the size because the color is beautiful. It's black, of course, um, but the size is a little too big for me now. I used to carry big bags, but um, this one's just too big for me now. Although I should keep it and I probably will. Um, we'll see, we'll see because if someone was to uh, offer me a good price for it, I would definitely take it. Um, yeah, let me show you my bag. I'm not going to tell you where I got this. Do you know why? Because when people come on here and they tell people where they got their things that are secondhand, those stores start jacking their prices up and making us suffer. Like, you got it for free. I've said this before in my videos. You got it for free. Why are you trying to charge what you'd have to pay in a retail setting? Like, what? That's not nice. Like, don't you want to keep your customers? Yes. Yes, it's Balenciaga, and yes, it is real. Isn't she happy? Isn't she wonderful? Oh my God, stop it, Lana. I'm just a little excited, that's all. <clears throat> so I've got a bunch of these in it to keep its shape. It is the silver plaque with the all the information on it it's a hundred percent authentic i'll tell you that right now um the beautiful straps the gorgeous fringe that is very classic of balenciaga um it's stunning Stunning, stunning, stunning. Um, there were no, there was no mirror. I don't think it actually, this one comes with a mirror, but it is gorgeous. It smells like it just came out of a box. It's, it's like, this stuff excites me like nothing else, nothing else. Um, like I said, I'm not going to tell you where I got it because I don't want those people jacking the prices up for you. I love it. I'm going to keep it pretty sure. Um, retail on that bag. If I get it wrong, I'll put it somewhere here to let you know that I got it wrong. Um, retail, I believe is about 2000 and I don't have a problem carrying a fake bag. I don't have a problem carrying a fake bag at all. Uh, a lot of people do have a problem with it because <laughs> I don't know why. I, honestly, I don't have a clue why. But 
I love this thing. I have a very good eye for really high-end items, bags, clothes, shoes. I have a very good eye. Um, will you find one of these bags? Eventually, you probably will. Um, you can go to Facebook Marketplace where people are selling them for super cheap because they're looking to buy something else. Um, you can go to Craigslist. You can go to thrift stores. Uh, there are tons and tons of places you can get these bags for cheaper than retail. So anyway, I wanted to show you what I got. Um, I will call it a thrift store. I will, because it was a thrift store. But will I tell you which thrift store? I don't even think that it's worldwide, this specific thrift store. But I'm not going to tell you. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about that, but I'm just not going to tell you. So, but I did want to show you. This is my thrifted find. I'm a very lucky girl. I'm very, very blessed. That's the way I look at it. It's gorgeous. I love it. Hope you guys liked the video. Um, I have another one coming up too. I just don't know when I'm going to be able to get around to it. So uh, enjoy my weekly vlog.